welcome we are going to solve this using two methods so watch to the end because the last method is very interesting and straight to the point let's go so the question says you should solve for five to the power of y plus one now um let's use the law of indices or exponents that states that a to the power of m all right multiplied by a to the power of n is equal to a to the power of m plus n all right now we have something similar here because this is already expressed in this form okay so let's split it in this form if we do that we have that 5 to the power of y minus 1 equals 11 so this implies that 5 raised to the power of y multiplied by 5 raised to the power of minus 1 is equal to 11, right? Now, x to the power of minus 1 is equal to 1 over x, all right? So that means that this same thing as 1 over 5, right? So we can now rewrite this as what? You can rewrite this as 5 to the power of y multiplied by 1 over 5 is equal to 11. So this implies that 5 to the power of y times 1 is still 5 to the power of y. So we have 5 to the power of y divided by 5 is equal to 11. Now let's cross multiply. If we cross multiply, we are going to have that 5 times 11, which is 55, is equal to 5 to the power of y. All right. Now, recall that we are looking for the value of 5 to the power of y plus 1. So, all we need to do here is to add plus 1 here. And to add plus 1 here simply means multiplying both sides of this equation by 5, right? Okay. So, if we do that, we have 55 multiplied by 5 is equal to 5 to the power of y multiplied by 5. Now, 55 multiplied by 5 will give us um, 275, right? is equal to 5 to the power of y. Now, because they have the same base, we are going to pick one base and we add the powers. That is y plus 1. Okay? So this simply means that 5 to the power of y plus 1 is 275. Now, this is the first method. Now, let's go to the second method. All right. But before that, if this is the first time you're coming across this channel, please hit the subscription button and on your notification bell so you'll be notified anytime I upload a new video. Thank you so much. Now we are asked to solve for what? 5 to the power of y plus 1. Now 5 to the power of y plus 1 can be written as 5 raised to the power of y. Now 1 is same thing as 2 minus 1, right? So that is minus 1 plus 2. Okay, so we have 5 to the power of y plus 1 is equal to, now this is same thing as 5 to the power of y minus 1, right? Multiplied by 5 to the power of 2. Yes, if we use our law of what? Exponential indices. Now, when you look at this closely, we have gotten our solution already. So we have 5 to the power of y plus 1 is equal to 5 to the power of y minus 1 multiplied by what? 20. Five. Now, we have that 5 to the power of y plus 1 is equal to 5 to the power of y minus 1 is what? 11, right? Is 11. So that means the whole of this is 11 multiplied by 25. So when we solve that, we have 5 to the power of y plus 1 is equal to 11 times 25. We, the trickiest way to do that is to just spread these two. Write 2 and 5 are apart. Add them to get what you have as your answer. Thank you so much for watching. All these tricks are in on this page. Tricks of how to solve several things. Just check the playlist on tricks, mathematics tricks, and you are going to see so many of them. If you watch to this place, just tap write, yes, I did, in the comment section. And I'm going to give you a big hug. Thank you so much for watching. Have a lovely day.